Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to find the solution for the given partial differential equation. This is of the form capital P into small p plus capital Q into small q equal to capital R. So from this, capital P is y plus z, capital Q is z plus x and capital R is x plus y. To get the solution, we have to solve dx by capital P equal to dy by capital Q equal to dz by capital R. Now, we are going to substitute dx by y plus z equal to dy by z plus x equal to dz by x plus y. Now, let's take the multiplier because from this, if I choose any two terms, it is not possible to find the solution by integration. So, now we are going to use Lagrange's multiplier for the first one it is 1, for the second one let us use minus 1 and the third one 0. So, this is equal to, so we have to once again write everything dx by y plus z equal to dy by z plus x equal to dz by x plus y. Now, this is multiplied with 1. So, if I multiply with 1, so it remains the same. This we multiply with minus 1 and this is with 0. Now, using the ratio property, we are going to add all the numerators. So, numerator is dx minus dy and the third is 0. Here it is y plus z minus z minus x. After cancelling this, we have dx minus dy by y minus x. In the same way, we are going to take another multiplier. So, use Lagrange's multiplier. So, we have taken 1 minus 1 0. Now, let us take 1, sorry, 0, 1 and minus 1. So, once again, from this, I have to continue by multiplying the multipliers. So, the first term, 0 dx by 0 into y plus z. The second is 1 and 2. So, the terms will remain as it is. And the third one is minus dz by minus x minus y. Again, using the ratio property, let us add all the numerators. So, it is dy minus dz whole division. This is z plus x minus x minus y. After cancelling this, this become dy minus dz whole division z minus y. But again, we can take one more multiplier that is 1, 1, 1. So, using Lagrange's multiplier one 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 so this entire term will be coming as it is that is dx by y plus z equal to dy by z plus x which is equal to dz by x plus y now let's add all the numerators so dx plus dy plus dz whole division. By adding all the denominator, we get 2 times of everything. So, 2 times of x plus y plus z because we find there are 2x, then 2y and 2z. Now, we are going to equate all these terms together. 
that is after using the Lagrange's multiplier we got some result so those results I am going to equate because everything is equal to this original ratio this whole thing is equal to this and this and this so finally by equating this we are getting dx minus dy whole division we get y minus x now this is dy minus dz by z minus y and this is dx plus dy plus dz is 2 times of x plus y plus z since we are not able to take any two terms and solve from the original expression we use the Lagrange's multiplier and we got a new expression now from this it is easy to take first and last that is this first term after taking d common it is d of x minus y and here taking minus common it is x minus y this is equal to the last one taking d common we get x d of x plus y plus z whole division the 2 is separately there as a half and this is x plus y plus z now we go for integrating on both the sides this is of the form dt by t which can be written as log t so this is minus log of x minus y and this we have half and even this half can be cross multiplied and taken it here so it will become minus 2 log x minus y and this is log x plus y plus z since everything is log we can take c1 as log c1 and now taking this to the other side and log c1 to the other side so minus log c1 equal to and when this becomes 2 log of x minus y plus log of x plus y plus z now using the power rule this 2 will come as a power here so this is log x minus y whole square plus log of x plus y plus z and this when I take it as a power we get log c1 power minus 1 using the power rule so here we can write this as log of 1 by c1 here we can combine the log log a plus log b log a b so it is log x minus y whole square into x plus y plus z now removing log we get 1 by c1 as x minus y whole square into x plus y plus z and this we can take it as the constant a in the same way we can choose another two term let's choose the second and third so when I take d common we get y minus z and in the denominator we have z minus y taking minus common we get y minus z and on the other side we have d common so it is d of x plus y plus z and 2 we can carry to the other side so it is easy to combine with the log after carrying the 2 to the other side we left with only x plus y plus z again this is of the form dt by d is log t so it is minus 2 log of y minus z and this is log of x plus y plus z and this is log c2 in the same way carrying the terms to the other side minus log c2 equal to 
टू लॉग वाई माइनस जेड प्लस लॉग एक्स प्लस वाई प्लस जेड यूजिंग द पावर रूल टू विल कम टू द पावर माइनस विल कम टू द पावर सो लॉग सी टू पावर माइनस वन इक्वल टू दिस इज लॉग y minus z whole square plus log x plus y plus z. So this is log one by c two equal to. Come in the log. We get log of y minus z whole square into x plus y plus z. Now removing log on both sides, we get one by c two equal to. Y minus z whole square into x plus y plus z, and that can be taken as b. After getting a and b, we can give the general solution, which is of the form f of c one comma c two equal to zero. But we have got the reciprocal, so we named it as a and b. So it is f of a comma b zero. Now f of a is X minus y whole square into x plus y plus z comma b is y minus z whole square into x plus y plus z equal to zero. So we got the general solution, and our solution. may vary if you would have taken the another two pairs so if i would have taken the first and second i would have got a different expression so even that is also possible so here we have taken first and last and second and last and we got a different solution in the same way we could have also choose the first and second so in the solution one part will be different And uh, this will have a multiple solution, and every solution according to the procedure is the correct solution.